let's look at example 4 where we're going to do the partial derivative in this case z equal to sine inverse of 2xy so z depends on x and y so when x change z will change and y change z will also change now to find out dz dx this is equal to a differentiate with respect to x sine inverse of 2xy how do we differentiate sine inverse of 2xy? We recall that differentiation of sine inverse u is 1 over square root of 1 minus u square then multiplied by the u dx. So in this case, my u is equal to 2xy now. So you get 1 over square root of 1 minus u square which is 2xy whole thing square then differentiate with respect to x 2xy. So 2xy, you square it, you get 4x squared y squared. And differentiate 2xy with respect to x. Remember that when you do partial derivative, the other independent variable y is fixed. So 2y is fixed number. You pull up the constant factor 2y. You end up differentiate x with respect to x, which is 1. And in the end, you have 2y over square root of 1 minus 4x squared y squared. This is dz dx. How about dz dy? It is not necessary to do the differentiation all over again, actually, because by symmetry, as the row of x and y are interchangeable in the expression z equal to sine inverse to xy. So you just interchange x and y, you find that dz dy will be equal to 2x over square root of. 1 minus 4x squared y squared.